is Glenda and I'm making now the embeds for the hot cocoa and mint soap that you may have seen earlier this week. Um, it's very easy to do the candy canes. I'm pretty much just rolling a long piece of soap dough into like a snake and I do the same with the white color and pretty much what I'm gonna do next is once they have the same thinness I'm gonna cut two pieces of the same length and I prefer to work in shorter um, strands and I just twist them around each other pretty much until I had the pattern of a candy cane and then I just roll it and I learned that it works better to just roll it in one direction like to only go down or to only go up because if you do it both the it, it loses the pattern however that's not the end of the word you can just twist it back in whichever direction you need to to recover the pattern of the candy cane once you're happy with that um, you just pretty much flip the top in this case I use my finger as a guide to just twist it as a cane shape and then this was a little bit too long so I went ahead and cut it and rounded the edges with my fingers I did adjust the pattern once more before cutting it um, the length of the longer portion to the length that I needed it and once I was done I just move on to the next cane until I was done the marshmallows are also very easy to do. I just pretty much rolled um, a long shape and then I just pushed it in to create that somewhat starting to melt marshmallow look and I'm gonna do it a few times so you can see. I grab just a piece of white soap dome then I just roll it and I get this very rough oval shape pretty much and then I just push the ends in and as I'm pushing the ends in with one hand, with the other, I'm rolling, I'm just rotating. And I'm going to accentuate that rotation so that it has a fairly cylinder-like shape. And that's pretty much it. There are many ways to do it though. I've also seen some people who just roll a big, long cylinder and then they just cut pieces off of it. Um, I was only doing a few, so I just did them individually. If you have not watched the soap in which I use these embeds, I'm going to put a link in the description box below so you can take a look. And that's it. Thank you for watching, and see you next time. Bye.